um, it's another day. I uh, want to take you through my journey of uh, buying a house. Um, I bought an okay, yeah, I bought an apartment, and um, I need to go and do the paperwork and also just check that um, the construction works are going on. So if you've been watching, my, if you've watched my other videos, the last time I bought an apartment off plan character development 101 so this time i really have to follow up the construction of the house that's what i'm gonna check right now i need to make sure that the developer is keeping his promises and everything that he told me so that uh, the house should be ready by april for occupation so i want to do the paperwork I also want to make sure that um, the construction works are going on well and um, everything is going as per plan so I kind of believed him because they've been working throughout Christmas and New Year and all that so um, I think it's a good sign to be in trouble again like last time so I'm welcoming you along on that journey we are gonna i'm gonna give you a tour of the apartment and um yeah so you wanna keep it here so that um we can check it out together so it is somewhere in kitangela and um when you see the apartment you will understand why i picked it <laughs> i probably um another video but yeah so this is the road it's um a sunday afternoon so not too much traffic but you come here during the week i am told it is crazy here so this is somewhere around athi river but one advantage is that i hear that um, there's a train station dear guys actually crosses here a train station in um, is it Athi River or Kitangela? Mm, Athi River. Athi River. So technically, you can take. Um, I don't know if it's a matatu. You're gonna need or yeah, a bus to Athi, to Athi River. So this is the road to that truck coming from. That's where. I think that's where you branch off to Athi River. Yeah, that road there, that's where you branch off at. So, that's the plan. I hope they can complete the house. <laughs> and um, I definitely am going to give you the story of the other house, what happened, the one that was in Gara. You guys probably have seen the show houses that I have created on the same. And um, this house is going for uh, about 20, 27,000 US dollars in Kenya money it comes to about 2.9 so 2.9 million 2,000 no 2 million 900 no wait 900,000 but I was able to get a small discount and um, yeah, so that's one of the reasons why I decided to go with this as an option because remember like the other house, the one in um, Athi no, the one in Ngara, it's been almost five years and the house was never has never been built. I don't think it's ever going to be built. So I didn't want a situation where I'm putting in too much money. It was too big of a risk. The other house, I put in 3.9 million that's about $37,000 so I didn't want a similar situation so I wasn't prepared to put in more than $30,000 on any house so I went with this one it's a little outside of town which is a great thing because with the road network Nairobi the, ne the, the road network is really good and with the rails and all, it's okay I mean and with a lot of people working um remotely so there's a good market and um there's like two universities around the area where the house is so i'm not too worried but even if there wasn't um 
if I don't get a tenant immediately, it's fine because it's not like I had to take a loan for the house, so it's okay. The house can sit there for a while, but I'm just excited to show you guys the house. We're gonna do a tour, it's still um, mostly a shell, but we're gonna like get a sense of how the house looks like. And you are welcome to come with me on that journey. And um, I hope you're gonna love it. I'm hoping you guys love it. But even if you don't, let me know in the comment section below. And something else, um, yeah, no, let's just wait and get there. So, yeah. Kitangela town, very, very busy, as you can see. Busy like crazy, cray, 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 busy. So it's one of those really busy and dusty. <laughs> oh, 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 man, I'm gonna get copyrighted, man. Yeah, this is Kitangela. Very, very busy. Kitangela Mall. Yeah, so that's one advantage of this area. You have pretty much everything. You want schools, you want universities, you want farms, you want hospitals. They have everything here. This is the house. I'm going to give you a tour, so come on in. So, this will be the kitchen. It opens up to this area. So, there's a neighbor here and another neighbor there, but this is like the kitchen window. And then you get so it's not complete guys like i told you i buy this apartment off plan so yeah so you just come into the house this is like a living room i love 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 how airy the space is and um it's gonna be yeah so you come in like that and then this part here and uh, this is a kitchen area Again, guys, not yet complete, but I love it. That's why I bought at this point because I can modify the house how I like. And this is the window, huge, huge window. So one thing you're gonna notice is um, the house has so much lighting in it. And then you walk into this corridor here, and um, on the left hand side, there's bedroom one. Again, a lot of lighting. You can see there's a window here. I just wish. This window was much bigger, or it, it looks really unproportional to me, but I mean, I'm going to ask them if they can push it to the side or I don't know, open it. It looks very really unproportional to me, but whatever. And this is going to be the wardrobe area. So guys, you want to subscribe to the channel so you can see how I'm going to transform this house. And this is the toilet. I love that it has a separate toilet and separate bathroom so this is a bathroom and then this is a corridor and um, so viewing from the kitchen area so there's a bedroom here this is your toilet this is your bathroom and then there's another bedroom right here i love at least this one has some symmetry i love the window it has some symmetry in it very very spacious as well oh, not very spacious when i read the colors yes this will be the wardrobe area right here you're gonna have your wardrobe and it opens up to this view guys oh my word this it opens as a garden out here so let me walk you and take you through the garden um so right here so this is where we are um this is the living room <laughs> if you're looking for a physical trainer he is right here give yourself a Hello. shout out I don't go coach, I don't go. Yes, uh-huh. Um, and then, so this is going to be a sliding door. There's going to be a sliding door here. And then out here, you can have your washing machine over here. And guys, voila, it's my favorite, favorite part of this apartment. Like, I cannot wait to transform the apartment and just show you guys how it's gonna be. Ideas are welcome. So there's a garden out here. It's big, like it goes all the way that end and goes all the way here. So let's show you from that bedroom, the bedroom that you just showed. You just showed so. <laughs> so this is the view. Come and show them. 
So this is the garden and like you open up right into the bedroom. So you can see bedroom two over there, bedroom one over here and there's this big window. And of course, there's gonna probably be a neighbor there staring, but whatever. And you have the whole of this section. So guys, um, I am so, you. So I am so excited to show you guys the development of this apartment, how it's gonna change. And you're welcome to walk with me through the journey. So, like I mentioned, um, bought the apartment for two about twenty-seven thousand dollars, two point eight million Kenya shillings. But currently, I think I'm with three million or thereabouts. So, yeah, guys, I am so excited to walk through this journey with you guys, and you are welcome to come along. So, Kujeni subscribe, hit the notification bell. It's on the right hand side of the subscribe button. So that you can follow the journey of me transforming this into a livable space. 